hello everyone today we are going to see what is efs and how we can mount efs to an ec2 instance or number of ec2 instances so efs is a storage service that is provided by aws and the efs stands for elastic file system it is a simple scalable and fully managed elastic nfs file system that could be mounted to a single ec2 instance or number of ec2 instances so let's see how all of this works by getting into the aws console so we'll go to the console and we'll go to the services tab we will first create an efs file system by going to the storage and selecting efs so here we will be clicking create file system i'll be naming my file system as efs demo and uh, the vpc is default and we have cre successfully created an efs file system now we will go to the security groups and i'd like to show you the security group that i'll be attaching to the ec2 instances so i'll open security groups and my sg is the security group that i'll be attaching to the ec2 instances so so we'll check out the inbound rules first so in the inbound rules we are allowing traffic from uh, ipv4 ipv6 we have given ssh and this is the comp uh, most important rule for efs to work or for efs to get mounted to ec2 instance that is the NFS rule, port range is 2049 and the source is the security group itself. So this is what we have to uh, lay our emphasis on. This is the one rule that is very important. And the outbound rules are as usual. So having, having said that, we'll see... Uh, now we are going to launch uh, EC2 instances. So I'll go to the instances section and I'll launch instances. I'm selecting the Amazon Linux AMI. Okay, and uh, next configure details. Now I'll be launching two instances. Now in this section, I'll be mounting the EFS. So here you see file system. So I'll save add file system and this is the EFS demo that is the file system that we just created and we have uh, attached that to this two EC2 instances. Now we can keep proceeding. So security group is the my SG security group with that NFS rule as we have seen before that is this one. So review and launch, launch. Okay, proceed without a key pair, launch instances. Now view instances. So now our instances are up and running. The EFS file system has been successfully mounted to the EC2 instances. And uh, in the next video, we will see how to verify whether the EFS uh, file system has been uh, mounted to our EC2 instances or not. So I hope you like this video. Please like, share and subscribe and see you in the next video.